So we all have this endless list of tasks and projects and things to think about, and it can get pretty overwhelming. To be honest, for a long time, I felt like my life was a complete mess. But then a few years ago, I discovered a completely free and totally game-changing app called Notion. Hey friends, how's it going? If we haven't met yet, then my name is Ali, and I'm a doctor turned entrepreneur, YouTuber, and podcaster. And I've been using Notion for over three years for my personal life, and now we also use it to run our team of 15 people. We've got a $5 million business built basically entirely on top of Notion. And as a massive productivity nerd, over the years, I've tried out dozens and dozens of productivity apps, but the one I keep coming back to and the one that I still think is the best way to organize your personal and your professional life is Notion, and it's also free. The first thing we're going to talk about is a funky little website called Aption, Aption.co. It's free. It's great. It's good vibes. And essentially, it's Notion-friendly, embeddable widget apps. What does that mean? Well, let's find out. Let's say I want to have a flip clock. Cool. I like the idea of having a flip clock as part of my Notion page. So I'm going to hit flip clock and it's going to say, try in your page demo. Paste the URL into your Notion's embed block. Quick tutorial, paste in Notion, click embed, done, you're ready to go. Cool. Flipclock.tk. I'm going to copy that URL. I'm going to go into Notion into LifeOS and let's say, I don't know, underneath the dashboard, I want to have the time right now. So I'm going to paste that link. I'm going to hit create embed. Boom. I have a flip clock. It's currently 146. That's pretty cool. Let's see what other random apps we can play with. This is kind of cool. This is a fun, a fun thing to browse. Moon phase, comments, Pinterest, charts, time. I kind of want the weather. I've got a weather one. Let's search. Weather widget. Yes. Perfect. Visit the website and get your HTML code. Generate the embeddable URL. All right, let's do it. So. Visit website. And now this option thing has generated an embed. So I'm going to copy that. I'm going to go into my thing. And let's say I wanted my weather to appear, zoom out a bit, just underneath my dashboard. Let's hit paste, create embed. Let's see what happens. Boom. We've got the weather. Incredible. But I don't like the fact that it's in there. I want to put it there. And now I have got the weather in my Notion dashboard. So that was one way of embedding widgets using option, which is completely free. Let's now use another website, which is Indify, which is also pretty solid. And this is also free. And it's a nice way of getting, getting interesting widgets for your Notion. So I'm just going to sign up with Google. Thank you. Add a new widget. Let's create a widget for quotes. Why not? Quote of the day. Continue. It's just kind of fun. It's kind of fun to play with this sort of stuff. Generating new widget. And let's just use this. And I can select different. Let's do the good quote. Why not? Set background color. I can make it white. And let's copy this embed URL. It's copied to clipboard. And now let's put it under today. I'm just going to paste it. I'm going to hit create embed. And hopefully we should now see a quote of the day. There we go. So this is just kind of cool. Option, Indify. There's a bunch of other websites that have sprung up recently that let you create these embeddable Notion widgets. It, it's kind of nice to have. You might like to create these. I'm just going to delete them because I don't personally like them. You might like to create these for your life operating system or for whatever Notion pages you want. But again, just keep in mind, this is all kind of fun to play with. You almost never need these things. You can embed a Google Calendar as well if you want, so you can see what your calendar looks like. And it's like kind of up to you to play around and figure out how you want to extend your life operating system based on widgets and other funky stuff. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to like and subscribe to stay up to date on all of our latest videos.